Nah. I'm a Maori. Um, I just called that out the corner of my eye. It's kind of how it looked. Right, so we have this, right, which I'm not going to explain because I'm authentic. I don't judge myself. Um, but what I will explain is this part, which is the noodle. Okay, you know, the scale of okayness of noodles is like, it goes from, most noodles are total shit, they taste like shit, these taste okay, um, they do, there's some kind of Polish shit. You know, I'm not being racist. And this is going to be a very short mukbang because you don't get many noodles in the cake. So there's not really much to eat here. But I wanted to do a mukbang. Uh, normally I do it with melon, um, watermelon. Yeah, they're good. They're good. I'll have to get some more of these. But the only problem with that <laughs> I'm gonna lick that off the table. I'm gonna be who I'm gonna be. I don't like it. Then that's a shame. Um, I won't be getting any more because I don't eat junk food. Junk food makes me fat. Because with junk food, I can literally eat like, I was at my fattest when all I was eating was pot noodles because I'd moved in here, yeah. I had no cooker, I had no fridge, I had fuck all, right? I had a kettle. I had something, anyway, something for hot water, right? A kettle, probably. Um, I remember buying it in John Lewis, and um, I was eating pot noodles every day for weeks. And um, that's the fattest I've ever been. So, I won't be buying any more of these. Um, you see, because if I got to make a sandwich, right, because I ain't got this thing here, yeah, um, I'm going to put that off until I'm that freaking hungry that I have to make myself a sandwich. You know, but with this... You know, I'm going to eat as soon as I feel a little bit hungry. I'm going to make one of these. You know what I mean? That's the difference that I'm talking about. These are nearly finished, so this video is not gonna be very long. Oh. 
and fish a bit of table. Mmm, found hair. Um, right. So, in my opinion, I made a really good video because it was balanced. It was like. You don't have to watch the video to understand what I'm on about. But it was balanced. It gave like two things that were relevant to a situation. And one was a good thing. And one was, uh, well, well you, can, you can only really call it a negative thing because it was, yeah. These, these are not your usual shit. Um, I mean, yeah, they're shit because they're just cheap. Well, you know, I back off from that hard because, like, cheap doesn't mean, like, bad. Um... What it is, is they're very tomato-y. Personally, I just think they're noodles in tomato powder. Maybe a bit of onion powder thrown in, you know, something like that. Um, and they're very nice. Because tomato has flavour and that chemical mix shite that's in most noodles does not have flavour. Sodium glutamate, what not. I'm going to tell you the story of my bowl. Um, it's dirty. <laughs> it's dirty. Um, I don't know why I used it for beans, but it was full of beans and I'd emptied the beans out and I'd not washed it up and it had all dried up and that's that's what happened to my bowl. I only have one bowl. All my dinner plates are bowls because this is from the days when um I was living at this hostel, right? And it's not about where I was living. It was about what I was eating. I was eating mash, peas and sausages, right? Um, I wasn't vegetarian at the time. I was a meat eater. And I used to go to... Um, I mean, I really liked them to start with, the sausages. I used to, used to go to a butcher's called Grasmus and they had a massive selection of sausages which really appealed to me, you know, um, but they were kind of all samey, you know. Um, but for a long time, you know, I enjoyed trying, you know, I pretty much tried them all, you know. Um, and I went to Grasmus until I bought burgers and there was just so much blood in the burgers that I... I, I gave up on graspers. I was like, no. Um, but I used to have sausages, mash and peas, and I used to have it in a bowl because of the gravy. The bowl would hold the gravy and it was, ooh. Okay, ooh, it's not very expressive. It was, it meant that I could have the deepest gravy, you know, and when you're digging around in the bottom, because the mashed potatoes are in the bottom, you're digging around in the bottom for the mashed potatoes, you're pulling the mashed potatoes up through the gravy with some peas on, mm, delicious. So all my dinner plates are bowls from back then, you know, um, I haven't changed since then. Um, and 
So I have bowls, yes, but not the kind of bowl that you want to eat eating like noodles out of. So, job done. Look at this. Two dirty bowls on my table. What I'm going to do, as I've got a minute or two left, um, is I'm going to pick them up and I'm going to put them in the kitchen. Because, you know, if they stay in the living room, they are just never going to get done. So, I'll just throw them down there. Um, and that is mukbang noodles. Um, yeah, so, hope you enjoyed it. Have a good one. Hope you, um, hope you find a lot on YouTube that you like. And, and that is really dope, you know, um, to be real. Me personally, I don't find that much that is good. Um, you could see that as like a very um, negative statement. But I spend most of my time just chilling. No TV, no YouTube, no music. You know, I have, um, I've ordered all the parts I need apart from, you know, these little connector blocks you can get. They've got two little screws in and you put a wire in one side, a wire in the other side. And that you screw, you screw the screws, two screws in and it connects two wires together. Yeah. I need two of those. Um, do I need two or four? I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, but that's all I need when all my shit arrives um, to make a boom box with sub bass. Um, it won't be, it will, what it will be is it will be a completely flat frequency response right from the deepest bass to 20k, 20,000 hertz, 20. 20,000 hertz, yeah. Um, so it's not going to be like bassy because they're only like 10 centimetre speakers, but that that's what I'm gunning for. Um, I want small speakers because I have the experience of like that it brings out the vocals more. The bass will drown everything out, you know. Uh, smaller speakers will have less bass, but the, there will be sub bass in there. You know, um, and it's all about, it's all about the mid range. It's all about the vocals. You know, I'll be able to sing along to the vocals. And I had this little boom box a few years ago and I used to sing to Tovlo, you know, and I used to really enjoy it. And I'm going to be doing that again. Maybe, maybe. Maybe I've changed. Maybe I don't like TV. Maybe I don't like YouTube. Maybe I don't like music. You know, um, I mean, I listen to music today, you know, on headphones. When I'm out and about, sometimes I do. But, um, you know, I, I've just watched PewDiePie. But, um, you know, the TV pretty much stays off. I mean, if I'm going to watch something, I'm going to watch it on my phone, but I very rarely watch something on my phone. Last time I watched something, I watched it for half an hour. I paused it to do something else and I didn't bother watching the rest. And it was blinding. It was fucking brilliant. Um, she was in a lake in the woods and this bloke was aiming a rifle at her and she just stood there chill, you know, the, the right way to do. You know, and he lifted his rifle and he fucked off, you know. Um, anyway, I'm going to go quickly. Goodbye.